And good morning. It is Monday, June 17th, 2024. We are back on the trail. I uh, got some new sneakers. I uh, got some new pole ends. Uh, I feel like it's the first day of school. So I had a great day and a half off at my buddy's house. Uh, first day there, I had a lot of work to do. But got that done yesterday so we could just chill. We watched some US Open golf, watch Rory McElroy choke away a master or a, uh, a major. Which was, I felt bad for him, but he choked it. Uh, went out for wings, got some Taco Bell, and then just laid around, which was awesome. Thank you to my buddy Joe and his family again for being such accommodating and gracious hosts. Uh, I'm forever indebted. That was an awesome break for sure. Today, I haven't even looked at the map. I'm just going to hike. And at about 5 o'clock, wherever I am, whatever miles I've done, I'll set up my tent. So... We are just chilling today. And it's about 76, so not too bad. Yesterday would have been a brutal day to hike because it was well into the 80s, low 90s. So thankfully it's a little cooler today. I will be back. And good afternoon. It is a little after three on Monday, June 17th, 2024. And I do feel it's starting to cool off a little. Again, it's helped being in green pretty much the entire day, thankfully, because I think it hit, was going to hit like 90, 91 today. Um, but it's just starting to change. It's cooling off. In the woods, I actually, I've probably said it before at least once, that four to six time period on these hot days are usually a pretty good day to, uh, to hike. And especially today, although I did start to formulate a little bit of a plan about, uh, I don't even know how far now, maybe four or five miles ahead from here is uh, you come to a road crossing and then... Point three to the right. I don't know if it's east or west, to be honest, but uh, I saw a day hiker and he said, you take a right. There's a convenience store. So I'm thinking I might be able to get there by five and maybe have like a slice of pizza or something, you know, whatever a convenience store has for dinner. And then only like 1.4 miles when I get back on the trail is a tent site, which puts me only four miles from Harper's Ferry. So I can get up in the morning, bang out four miles, be in Harper's Ferry, get a nice breakfast, go to the Appalachian Trail uh, Conservancy Visitor Center. It's huge. They have all kinds of displays and info and history. And I'll you know, check that out for the morning. And then if I'm around during lunch, have lunch. If not, if I leave early, then and just leave. I'm not going to spend the night or anything. And then from there, you cross the uh, Potomac on a footbridge, and, and we'll actually be moving on to the next map bundle. So pretty exciting for sure. Crossed into West Virginia today, as you saw in an earlier picture. So that's the plan, and it doesn't look like any excuse me weather issues except heat for the next couple days so we know how to deal with that i'll be back all right it's 5 30 see somebody else with the same idea as me 
think that's Yukon Cornelius ahead of me. I just met him today. But there's the store. So we're close. So I'll go there, get something to eat, and head back the three tenths of a mile back to the trail. It felt like friggin' three miles on three tenths, but and then 1.4 to a tenth day. I'll let you know what I get to eat here. What's that, bud? Bug oh, bug spray? No. And good evening. I am at the Stony Brook Farm and Hostel. It's just an incredible place. Um, that's where you eat. And I just went there and got some, got some ice water and ice. Uh, it's a donation-based hostel. They were nice enough to come and get us at that convenience store that I went to at the last moment because me and a couple of guys I met there, uh, Yukon Cornelius and Cosmic, we did not want to walk any further. And honestly, the road that we took to get to the convenience store was pretty uh, dangerous. I felt my shorts get fluffed up a couple times from the cars passing so close but this is beautiful it's a working farm uh, they've got you know, blueberry fields and i'm in that middle cabin down there cosmic and yukon are in that one to the left but uh, just beautiful grounds as you can see we're in hillsboro virginia so i did cross into west virginia but when we walked up the road to the convenience store, we crossed back into Virginia. So uh, we're in Hillsboro, Virginia. If you can see way up there in the distance to the right of that yellow house, they're working in the fields right now, um, picking blueberries. They've got the high bush uh, that you can just pick, unlike Maine where you need the, where the, need the rakes, but it's pretty sweet here. Uh, that's the shower house up there. I'm gonna go Hit that, I'll check in with the guys and see if they've showered yet, but I needed some liquid first. I'm gonna take this water back and mix me up some Gatorade and get a shower and call it a night. Uh, talk to you all soon, have a great day.